I'm here because I have a general interest in creativity, as does, of course, the Arts Council. But more particularly because over the last year I've been chairing the Durham Commission, which is a joint venture between Durham University and the Arts Council, to look at the place of creativity in education in English schools. There has been a great deal of discussion recently about introducing a test for creativity through the PISA system. Um, and of course, any single test has its uh, limitations. But I think that it would be very useful, particularly in this country, for us to be able to engage in a general test of that kind, because it will allow us to set achievements in the United Kingdom against what's happening in continental Europe and elsewhere. And for us, I think that's a very, very necessary uh, path to take, because the English education system has over the last decade or more been very focused on examinations and certain kinds of testing and those those examinations and that testing have to some extent I think suppressed opportunities to promote creativity. I think it's crucial that young people have the opportunity to develop their whole being and their whole potential and I think crea teaching for creativity helps to encourage that. Uh, we all know that there are young people who uh, don't necessarily flourish with a certain kind of academic teaching. Um, they have uh, abilities that come out in other ways. And I think teaching for creativity gives every student the opportunity really to develop their particular potential and to make a particular contribution to society. We know that uh, teaching for creativity improves young people's well-being, it improves their mental health. Um, it gives, we know that employers are looking for young people who have uh, creative minds and who can test and question assumptions. So I think teaching for creativity really gives young people the biggest opportunity to flourish in the wider world. The key message I would want to convey is that there is, first of all, a sense, always a misconception that creativity is limited to the arts, that it is about what artists do, it's what writers do. Creativity is present in science, it's present, present in engineering, it's present in the social sciences, it's present in mathematics. Across every discipline, we need creative minds. And we've just heard a really distinguished Nobel Prize winning scientist talk about the absolute necessity to have creativity in the thinking of his students and his PhD students as well as uh, amongst artists.